Hey, what's up guys? Luminazeal here. In today's video, we're going to be trying out the new perk Shadow's Touch. It deals three true magic damage and heals you for three on melee hits. I've started to run this along with Dark Reflection, Soul Collector, and Anti Magic. I think it makes the melee warlock a lot better. I love the healing, the extra damage. It all just makes the melee warlock even better than it was before. And with that being said, I don't have too much of like crazy gear yet, but uh, yeah, just kind of been running it in solos and let's jump into some gameplay. Alrighty guys, let's run it up. Same thing as usual, grab our stacks here. Probably try to loot up over towards the middle. Honestly, these uh, changes have felt pretty good. Waiting to see how it feels a little bit later on when everybody's a lot more geared. I feel like the uh, armor and magic resist changes are probably the strongest and obviously the uh, all attributes. But right now it feels pretty good to clear and doing a lot more damage. Definitely actually want to uh, try out plate lock build. Been seeing uh, plate lock with uh, the Chris dagger, I think it is, and yeah, sounds pretty fun. I'll probably give that a give that a try, make a video about it. Let's come over here, break these uh, crates. They kind of see over here, just trying to loot up little by little early in the wipe. Good of that stuff. Nothing good here. So let's head on over here, and then obviously everybody kind of meets at the middle. It's just a big uh, brawl, and then everybody pretty much wants to go for the centipedes, get some early jewelry. So that's seven stacks. I think I hear somebody moving around. Oh, these look pretty good. Might be more moving speed. 93.8, 94, yep. So, keep these on. Take this guy out. I think we just aggro this up dude down there. Take this guy out. And then try to grab the middle chest. Anything? Not really. Here's somebody to my left here. Okay, just shut the door, so... Wait for this guy, sneak up on him. Oh, there's somebody else through the door that he's fighting. Let's get an axe at him. Hey, come back here! About to punch this man to death. Fist of justice! Die. Yeah, one more. Oh shit, okay. Barbarian here. Somebody over here too, holy. Fighter over here. This guy's got his fists out. Try to get those two to fight each other. I think the Barbarian's back the other way, so let's take this guy out quick. It's headshot. Dead. And this is the way that the fighter came. Is there another person? Uh, that just got crazy quick. Stay over here, heal. We got the Goblin Guard in the door. And it looks like the fighter cleared all this. I think we're safe here for just a second. Stand back just in case. Sounds like somebody else is on the other side of this door. Take a peek who it is. He's looting my kill. He's swinging around for something. Looks like a pretty uh, beefy barbarian. Let's swap uh, these pots out for all the better ones. Hey, big ball. Let's see here. Come here now. <laughs> Don't do that. That's mean. Oh man, he took out his uh, Francesca's a little bit. Put them away a little bit too slow. All right, there it is. There it is. Kind of knew that when got too close to him, he was still having his Francesca's out. He did get a few good hits on me though. Trying to loot my kill. Not gonna happen. Make sure we're fully healed here. I obviously heard somebody else. A lot of people in this room. Joe is pretty good. Purple. Movement speed and grab that. Uh, 
Magic persist. And max health. Alright, grab the treasure. Some heals here. Kinda went through a lot of heals. Oh, oh not search kit. Take that. I think that's good. Let's check this guy. Not too much. Okay. Let's keep it moving. Oh, there's a bard. Just gonna sneak up on him over here. Come on through, Mr. Bard. Might have heard me just there. Yeah, sounds like it. <laughs> just playing music, sneak up on him, and I just push through. Hello, big boy. Don't hit me with that. That's slow, or it's not slow, what? It's a uh, physical power reduction or something like that. True physical damage, we'll grab that. And don't need any of that. And yeah, can't pick up anything else up, so let's go kill the um, centipedes. I think that was the last guy in here. Maybe the last guy in the map. So let's just kind of loot up. Hoping for some purple jewelry. It's gonna get rich pretty quick. I found a uh, necklace of peace, purple necklace of peace with two all. It's just crazy how much was it sold for? Like, I think it was like four thousand or something. Let's see if it actually sells, but yeah, you can get rich really quick with uh, one good rolled piece of jewelry. And I got stuck there. It was weird. Grab the shrine. <laughs> Took the hit from that guy, but I mean, with the healing, shadow touch, we are good. Oh, wait, somebody here. They might be trying to go for the portal. Spawn like right above us. Look. Hey, get off of my portal! <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna tell myself that he was low because she's. Oh, four additional physical. Nice. We'll grab that. I mean, just... <laughs> absolutely just one-shot that guy. Oh, my gosh. Um, <laughs> uh, uh, I feel like... Cloaks go for a little bit, so we'll keep her cloak. And then, don't really need any of this. Kind of want that Chris dagger, though. Had two, what, magic damage on it? Or magical healing? Grab it. Go back down to the centipede. See here. Come here, Mr. Peed. We got our portal right above us now. She's kind of just hanging out. Purple jewelry. Let's bring this down first so you can get out. And that kind of sucks. This will probably grab it. But I don't think they sell for a lot, but all good. Let's get out of here. Take me home. Ooh, let's see. Peter Fighter. Doesn't look like he has. Yeah, doesn't have much. All good. All right, guys, and with that, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.